Hello, Fucius. Welcome. You are the 13th Zodiac. Very unique indeed. So welcome to your September 2021 horoscope forecast. Your Zodiac horoscope for September. So, Fucius, normally your birth date would be between November 29th and December 17th. And don't forget to include if you're born on a cusp. So it can go a few days either way as well. So keeping that in mind, my name is Jade. I'm the Violet Sage. I'm a psychic medium, minister, and Reiki master teacher. And I do many modalities of healings for over 25 years. Um, I incorporate what my guides tell me into these horoscopes as well. So whatever I pull for you today, you'll get a little bit of my input. And uh, also, I ask that you go ahead and check out the horoscopes before and after your sign, like Scorpio and Sagittarius, and whatever your rising signs may be, because they may resonate with you as well. So these are based on your sun sign, the one you're born under, but your zodiac and astrology chart has many other aspects to highly consider, such as your rising and moon signs. If you were born on a cusp, which is when you're close to the end or beginning of another sign, Please remember these are general readings because of those facts. And for a more accurate reading specifically for you, please contact me to schedule a reading, which you can do so with the information below in purple, the Violet Sage at AOL.com. Please put reading in the subject line so I could find it amongst all the other of the spam and junk mail that I get. Get overwhelmed with that stuff. <clears throat> all right. So doing your reading today, this is for September, um, this is a little shorter than normal, but that might be good, we're going straight to the point. All right, Spirit, what does the Fucius need to know for this month of September 2021? What's best going to help them in their path in life here? All right, first card up, ooh, that's cool. Green man, the green man. The green man, is that a cool card or what? initiative mm -hmm. fertilization and action initiative fertilization and action so it is time to take action now you have to fertilize the ground for your success in life this is the time to start taking action on your dreams what it is that you would like to accomplish so let's get started um there's no time like the present there's no time to wait your creative abilities are really at their prime juicing right now in September. Prime juicing. Love the words. All right, Spirit. What else do they need to know? What's a Fucus best help here in September 2021? What do we need to know for Fucus? I see a card that wants to come out. I'm not quite there yet. All right, here we go. Angel of the universe, you are being encouraged to expand your thinking, need to think outside of the box. So in order to get things accomplished, you have to do things in a different way. You can't continually do things the same way and expect different results. Now, I know you've heard that somewhere before, right? So same, same stands true now. So you have to do things a little differently, tweak your way of thinking incorporate something new in your visualization or into uh, your work. And this might be the key or the, the solution that you've been looking for. All right. Spirit, what else does a Fucius need to know? It might be of help for them this month of September. Ooh, there's something cool. I don't think I've ever pulled this card before. Dance, celebration. It is time to celebrate. You're going to have reasons to celebrate. Think outside the box, do what needs to be done, and you're going to see the doors opening for you. This is going to be very cool indeed. So dance to your own rhythm. Maybe maybe you've done things for other people their way for so long, it's time for you to, to try it your way. Or what is the real you? Has the real you even been able to come out and play? So do things a little differently and see where it gets you, right? And and if you have never danced to your own rhythm before, that's probably exactly what you need to do. Then we're going to go ahead and pick a stone for you. What is the best stone for a Fucius? 
this month of September. It's what's going to help their energy. We have Azurite. Azurite is another um, zodiac got that this month too. So Azurite is a really, it's a wonderful healing stone. It helps you, probably will help you think outside of the box. And it brings in a lot of ancient knowledge, a new perspective, a new way of doing things. Let's see, I have to bring this one up close to read it. There's a deep emotional healing to this one. <clears throat> Your heart is ready to heal from past experiences and you are willing to devote time and energy towards therapeutic care. That's good to know. Again, doing things a little different. Are you ready to finally give in and let the spiritual side take over? Help to heal you, mend broken hearts, heal the way you're thinking about a situation, all these sort of things. Let the vision take over. All right. So I hope that has been of some help for you this today for this month. We may be doing some weekly forecasts. Uh, we'll, we'll be working on that right along here. So please like, share, subscribe. If you're on YouTube, hit the notification bell. If you're on Facebook, hit the like and follow. But please, wherever you do, share because we really need people to subscribe, especially on YouTube. Uh, that's the only way I can get paid for this. So if you so feel kind enough to donate to our channel. It's much appreciated because I don't get paid for doing this right now. And I really deeply enjoy bringing this information to you, but you know when you have to spend time <laughs> doing what you got to do to make a living, it really, really genuinely helps. All right. So much love and light to you all and have a wonderful month and Get connected, get grounded, and think outside the box and wear some Azurite. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and ask Google what they say about it. What are the metaphysical properties of Azurite? Of a jury? No, I said Azurite. No. What is the metaphysical properties of Azurite? According to Crystal Vaults, Azurite in shades of indigo combines the intuition of the violet ray with the trust of the pure blue ray. It brings wisdom, truth, dignity, and spiritual mastery. A stone of judgment and long life, it promotes introspection and can result in profound wisdom when used well. How can you beat that? Azurite is one of those very unique stones. It's part azurine and malachite, I believe, which creates azurite. So it has a good protection field as well. So I hope this was of help for you. Much love and light to you all and have a wonderful fall. And we will see you soon, hopefully on one of my mini broadcasts. Till next time.